Okay, so today I'm going out to go and shoot a event for Bentley Motors here in the UK. And I've chosen to use predominantly the 7200 F2.8 G Master for Sony. The camera body I will be using is the A7 IV for the whole of this video, apart from any other clips that the GoPro shit like that. Um, anything else? Not really. Subscribe, please. Like, please. Comment anything the fuck you want. And we'll look at all the photos. Does that scare you? We'll look at all of the photos at the end. Oh, jokes. But seriously, does it scare you? So I'm just trying to get into uh, the place that I'm shooting the Bentleys. Uh, but because it's a festival, there's like loads of roadworks and traffic management. It's quite, look, look at it. And it, it's, it's so busy, like it's crazy busy. So they're having to do like one set of traffic at a time. Oh my god, this is gonna take ages. Ah oh, mate, you're right. Um, I'm table? doing content uh, for Bentley. Yeah. Um, I'm meeting them here, so yeah, I've got to bring them. You can you can meet them there, but you have to take your car into the yeah, car park. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. They're gonna come and get, I think the pass is for red car park anyway. Yeah, as long as they give you a pass, it's fine. That's fine, fine. just park anywhere here. Yeah, it's over, over there. Is over there. Awesome, cheers, thank you. Okay, so the plan for today is kind of like the, the proposal that I got given was to shoot like lifestyle content of people at at the festival well at the festival with the bentleys so there's a they've got like a, a site here uh like a, a stall uh and in that stall there's like a bunch of different uh bentleys and obviously people get to come and have a look at them when they're not watching the races and the idea is to shoot the content of the people looking at the cars so hopefully fingers crossed we'll be all right Okay, so I just thought it'd be easier if I threw on the GoPro so you guys could see what I'm shooting. It's very loud here and there is some uh, music around, so I'll try and talk as much as I can. But we've got the Sony A7 IV with the 7200 F2.4, uh, 2.8, sorry. Um, I've been doing a couple of shots over where kind of like the people were like landing with the helicopters and stuff, but I'm also here in the, the showroom. Um, we're just gonna get some shots of the car. I'm predominantly gonna be using this lens. I do have a wide lens and the 85, but I think for versatility reasons, I'm gonna be using mostly this. Um, yeah, let's get some shots. I'm gonna get some of the crowd as well, some street style shots of some of the people outside and, and that type of thing, and we'll, we'll go from there. Okay, so a couple over here looking at it. So we'll go, we'll go landscape, 320 per second, F4. Uh, ISO 160. That's yeah, alright, not bad for a first shot. We'll see what we can get. Um, maybe get these people kind of like around the black one in the middle. Maybe if I use like the front of this one as a bit of depth. That's quite cool. Uh, I'm thinking if I just move this back a bit and just get the front end of this car with like the compression of everyone else in the background, it's quite nice. Oh, that's nice. I mean, it is very busy, but you know, it's a, <laughs> it's a festival, so. Uh, so landscape shot. So kind of the idea from, uh... oh, sorry dude. So the idea from uh, Bentley was to shoot lifestyle content of people just kind of around the showroom arriving and kind of you know integrating themselves with the brand so i'm going to try and do that the best i can i think maybe from the outside shooting in it's actually quite a nice shot got this door as kind of a frame let's kind of make it a little bit more square well you know more of a frame so we'll pull that out so it's parallel we'll do the same with this one Let's go a bit more to about there. So then you've got that nice clean door frame. Oh, that's better. Much nicer frame. So we'll go at 70. I'm just going to shoot the people inside, really. You're good. No, you're good. Thank you. Okay, so there's a shot here I want to get because on top of that stand over there, there's the Bentley on top of the, uh, the stand. So I'm going to try and get something in the foreground, maybe like this, this bit of like hedge in the foreground, just change up the settings because it's too bright. 
We'll go F 4.5. Uh, and we'll go one thousandth of a second. We'll just wait for a clearer frame. No, you're right. Just trying to get that like lifestyle shot. I'm just up on this tower. Look. Just getting some shots of the bendies here. So they're going up and down this kind of like straight here, and I'm getting like top-down shots of them coming in because they go into this tent just here. So they come up here and then I'm taking shots of them. I've got the 85, 1.4 on. Any of the shots I get here, I will I will look at in a minute. Um, but we're just waiting for the racing to finish so I can get on with it. Um, once the racing's finished, so I can get on with the shots and get the, the day finished. Um, this is the last race anyway. And then once that's done, I can finally finish and get home. <laughs> it's been a long day, a very long day. But worth it, it's been good been good to shoot the cars um don't really give two fucks about the race but the cars look sick i mean look at them as you can see all here lined up so i was thinking a cool shot would be i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do it today but a cool shot would be if i had it all lined up here so have them like the gts the flying spears and then the ventagas all lined up there but i don't think i'm gonna have time because obviously like all the staff have got to get got to get home so It'd be a cool shot to do. A bit windy though, but it is what it is. We'll uh, we'll see. See how it goes. Okay, I think you'll agree that it was a good shoot. I enjoyed it. It was a great day. Nice day as well. Bit windy, but you know, you saw the hair go wild. Uh, it was fun. Uh, 7200. Do I recommend it? Yes. Go buy it if you can afford it. Definitely a great lens. There's also the f4 version, which is also a great lens. Um, look at the photos on the screen. Photos on the screen were taken with uh, multiple different lenses. Uh, I used predominantly the 7200 because it gave me that most depth uh, and I enjoyed using it the most. Now the event itself was a, a horse racing event. I don't personally like horse racing. I don't think it should be a thing, but anyway, that's my opinions. That's why I was there to shoot the event for Bentley and the people interacting with the brand and I think it went really well. I enjoyed the, the whole day as a whole. Um, and it was, it was exciting. Saw some famous people, saw Richard Hammond, saw Sir Alex Ferguson, of all people, um, and loads of other famous people that were there. It was cool, it was great to, to be in that environment, I guess, and, and I felt privileged and to be paid to be there. I thought it was quite cool. Everyone else was paying to be there, I was paid to be there, so I thought that was quite cool. It blessed us with an amazing sunset. As you can see with some of the images on the screen now, um, it was it was beautiful. It, it made a very good backdrop for the cars, and it just it just made the day. It, it, if that hadn't happened and it'd gone like grey and drizzly and shit, it would have been a, in my eyes not a very good shoot. But that sunset at the end just it just popped it off for me, and I just really really enjoyed the fact that I got some really tasty warm images from the shoot. Let me know in the comment section below. Did you like it? Let me know. Even if you didn't like it, I don't really care. Let me know in the comments anyway. We're gonna jump into the hashtag and see what you guys have been shooting over the last couple of days. If you aren't aware and you're new here, subscribe and get involved. I use the hashtag Optical Wonder over on Instagram where you guys can share me the content you're creating and in turn inspire me and other creatives while watching the same video. So we're gonna look at that now and maybe we'll do like five or five or seven. Okay, the hashtag is up to 348,000 posts, which is actually insane. By the middle of this year, I'm trying to get this hashtag to 500,000 posts, so if you could use it, I'd be very grateful. So we're gonna go down and just pick a couple. This is really cool. What a great shot. What a great series, love that. Look at the energy in that shot. Oh, what a, honestly, what a great series, great shots. Going down, um, oh God, there's so many great shots. Let's go with, I like this one because you've got like a, a longer shutter. So that means that everyone else is like kind of moving, but these two people in the middle are stood still. I love that shot. Really, really nice. Um, going down a bit more. Let's go with, oh, there's just so many great photos. Honest, like generally, look at this simplistic, like simplistic one. Just of this like white, is that a crane? I think it's a crane. Do you call that a crane? I think so in the middle of the frame. Everything else is kind of darker, contrasty to the bird. Great shot. Uh, look, look at the colors in this. Very simple shot, incredibly cinematic, but what oh, the colors, sunset vibes. Definitely the same vibes as the sunset that I had at Bentley and the Bentley shoot. 
Look at, whoa, look at that. That's so cute. Oh, sorry, that was kind of a personal one, but I like it. I like cats, sorry. Uh, this one here, love the colors, love the shadow, love the light on the dude's face. Highlights aren't too blown out, which is super amazing. Um, going down. Uh, we'll do, let's do two more. Let's go with this one, super clean shot. Wow, that's incredibly clean. Really love that. And we'll do the last one which will be a little bit of scroll and stop. And we'll go with this one here. Great framing, nice and clean. Really like that. Great shot. If you do want to get featured on this channel, you can use the hashtag optical wonder. Now, down in the comment section, I'd love you to jump down there and have a little, uh, just, just, just throw your opinion in there. Maybe drop some names of videos that you'd like to see. Some titles of, of videos and I will create the video around the title that you pick. So down in the comments, throw a title, and I will pick one title and I'll make a video about that title. So go crazy, it could be as random as you want. Um, going forward, the videos are gonna be very more, very much more relaxed. Um, I don't wanna like focus too much on making sure that they're like squeaky clean and, and professional. I want them to be raw and honest and, and just me and, and you guys kinda of hanging out and that's the vibe I wanna, I wanna have. So, going forwards, create more, stress less, and of course, I'll see you in the next video. Go and shoot. Go. Shoot. Don't watch me. Stop watching me. Turn it off. Subscribe on your way out, and go shoot. <laughs>